Welcome back everyone to Minecraft Generations. This is the entrance to the mine. Just burst up a little bit. Also, um, remember last episode I died at the end. And unfortunately all that stuff, well, it's gone now. But, as you can see, I've been doing a few things off camera. One of which being a little bit of mining down there. And, um, it's been going fairly well, except it's just no diamonds. Lots of redstone, but no diamonds yet. Um, also another interesting quirk of this version is you try to take a chest and put it above another chest. The one underneath it won't open. But it's not too big of a deal. So, um, you know, while, while I was digging around, um, I found a, no cave. Now, I'll actually, I was considering making like a wheat farm in this episode but with the way that this version works you can just kind of you know sit around go outside occasionally and be like okay where are the animals at you find the animals that are just around like those cows over there you kill them and then you know you come back you put the loot in here and then you repeat and they just, just keep spawning over and over again and I'll usually get lots and lots of goods. Which is probably a good reason for me to take at least some of this leather. And make the remaining bits of armor that I do not possess with them. For at least some protection early on. There we go. Now, hopefully, this um, cave I found will have some more diamonds in it that I won't actually lose this time by being kind of dumb and go walking around outside at night without armor on. I mean, that's not very smart. Also, this place isn't the safest place in the world yet, but that's okay. I'll occasionally find creepers down here also. Um... But yeah, once F3 becomes more readable by me, then the problem should go away. This is not the direction for the cave. Uh, nothing in there. Um, the direction for the cave is actually over in this direction. As you can see, I've been doing a little bit of strip mining, but like next to nothing has been found so far. So it's like, eh, not sure if I could, should keep doing it or not. See? Look at that. Bouncing Creeper. Where did it go? I know it's not dead. It should be in there. This is like over here now. There it is. Unfortunately, I don't have another um, iron pick at the moment. So I can't get that red stone quite yet. So it's carefully... Come up here. I don't think lapis is even a thing yet, is it? Hey. There. Oh, and look at that. Diamond! Like, right off the bat, this diamond. It's like... I spend... A ton of time strip mining. No diamonds. Whenever I'm just caving, diamonds. They happen. They happen all the time. It's like... The game is trying to tell me something. <laughs> It's pretty funny. Besides, um, regular caving is definitely a lot more fun than actual just strip mining. Which is definitely why I totally did that not on camera. Because, you know, I'd be like, oh, you strip mining. That's not interesting in the slightest. Who would want to watch that? Okay. And see, look at this cave. It's just full of iron. Which is something that I was, like, not getting, like, at all via strip mining. Not sure if this is a thing in this version or something. Oh, hi. Also, apparently I've learned that spiders do not yet possess the abilities that they do in games that I am more familiar with. Versions that I am more familiar with. That's right. Versions. 
Um, so yes. I told you to just jump and thaw and die in the lava instead of climbing up the wall. Like it normally would have been able to. But, you know, that's fine by me. Let's quickly make a furnace. And start smelting up some of this iron so we can actually make better tools. You know, that's actually also make a stone one still because I'm gonna mostly use the iron one on stuff like diamonds and such because, you know, they could only be mined with that and it'd be nice to, you know, have the ability to mine them at will, essentially. And let's just hope that this deposit of diamond over here... Is this way, right? Yeah, yeah. It's, it's more than just one. Yeah. I think I should just save the redstone mining for later because it takes forever for no good reason. And there we go. Just two. Good. Okay. Better than just one. So there's some water here. That's super fantastic, I guess. You know, it's like, oh, water. It's going to push me around. Again, I guess I really should use the iron one. You know, just, just for time saving, I guess. I don't even really need to go after even all the coal. I mean, yes, there's this possibility that, yeah, I can find caves like I just did. And I can find other things of more value behind it, but it doesn't mean I have to do it. Because, you know, then the whole most of the video just being uh, mining out coal, and you now it's going to get kind of boring. I also have this instinct to try and run occasionally, which is not even a feature, so I shouldn't really be bothering. Um, So is there anything down this way? Nope, not a dead end. Not a big deal though. At least there won't be any mob spawning from here anymore. That's a good thing. See how well the iron is going? Okay. It seems to be done. That's good. So let's go ahead and make another diamond sword. Because it's better than using all these stone ones. Hopefully not to die this time. So, you know, we have, like, armor and such. Let's make some better uh, hats and boots and such. Um, remember correctly, there's a lava pool, yes, but... There was a spider that visited us from above. So, indeed there is. Okay. And it's like, okay, it's not even a dangerous hole. Okay. Maybe I should grab at least a little bit of this. Just in case I need some torches. Okay. I hear footsteps. There's something there. They're pretty light footsteps, so it might be you. 
that's exactly what I thought it would be. Okay. Let's make a few more torches. Oh, that's good. Okay, anything else? It's a lot of darkness, so I should probably focus on that for the time being. Dead end. Okay. Not bad. Dead end, mostly. And, yeah. Big dead end. But at least there is some gold. And, if, I'm just glad I kept it digging, because right there, diamond. <laughs> Oh, that's good. Okay, come on, one more. I can't make a pick yet. Oh, I said, um, one of the things that, um, you know, I would require to advance would be um, you know, at least all the main tools that one would acquire and make diamond. So, that's one of the things I'm working towards. It's good to see diamond some more. Um, we're going to have to see a lot more. I want to actually want go back and stash these, just in case something happens. It's any in this case or anything, but there's one here apparently. How did I miss it? I don't know. What is here? So, let's see what is inside. Probably not much of anything. Nope, not much of anything. There's some coal, obviously, because, you know, this is a high, higher altitude cave. It's not going to be a lot in it, but it doesn't even lead anywhere, which is kind of disappointing, but oh well. So here's the entrance. You just kind of have to dig down, otherwise you're just going to take a bunch of damage. Otherwise, it's just not something I feel like doing. Especially since there's no regen. If there was regen, I mean, I was like, I'd be like, I'll think about it. And then, you know, as long as it's not like instant death drop, then I'll probably do it. But like, you know, if you, when you have to actually worry about your health all the time, it's like, nah, I don't feel like doing that. <laughs> And there's even some iron down here. How, how good that is. Because, you know, you can never have enough iron. Iron is, like, the best thing in the game. And some people are like, you know, yo, diamonds, yo. But, like, iron can just be made into so much more. Well, not, not necessarily at this point in the game, but... It doesn't hurt to gather some now. Just like the leather. Doesn't hurt to gather some that too. And this came pretty good. But I also do need diamond. Okay. A lot of lava here. I'm not sure if obsidian is even a thing yet. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm thinking backwards. Um, I had some lava flow into water, and I just remembered it was you have to put water onto lava. I was like, yeah, that's right. What are you thinking, you silly? Uh, okay, more iron. There doesn't seem to be a lot of monsters in these caves, which is odd. You expect there to be a lot of monsters. 
There's I would. There's like hardly any. Yeah, I heard some over here. I didn't see any. Nothing of interest, unfortunately. Someone splashing around in some water somewhere. Uh, wonder where that somewhere is, and that someone is. You know, I can hear you. They're not very discreet. Sounds like a zombie to me. Oh, is this the way out? Yeah. And it's nighttime up there. So, yeah, that would explain why there aren't a lot of mobs down here. Okay. Be a little careful around lava because, you know, it's pretty dangerous. It could result in death and the, you know, advancing of versions. Also the loss of items, but you know. Big K there. Is that lava them receding? Or is there another one? Yeah, there's another one. So I guess we could go this way for now. Oh, what's what do we have here? I'm here though. Hmm. Okay, just making sure nothing drops at me from up here. I mean, that would be pretty dangerous. And that's a dead end. Well, that's not. Good. Let's check out that cable over here. That one looks to be full of adventure. Shoot, <laughs> I ran out of, uh, don't have any iron with me. Oh, that's three. <laughs> We're just gonna have to get three more pieces. Until then, I guess we could scout ahead a little.
sounds to be my nemesis, the skeleton. Also, this lava is pretty annoying when it comes to get it going away. Let's help it along a little. That is something I definitely remember from playing these older versions. Lava takes forever. It's so slow. I'll just leave that there for now. Go on ahead. Oh, poor creeper. Doesn't like the water. It's hard for him to fight it. Okay, this is lead and nope, nope. This is the literal dead end. There you go. Leads nowhere. Ah, uh, there we go. That's better. And I, I was thinking there was going to be another one right there, but there isn't. There's some more iron. This is always good to find. I'm not sure, but it looks like there aren't any dungeons in this version, which is kind of disappointing, but oh well. We'll find them when they become available. <clears throat> oh, I guess we can check out this dark area. Look at that creeper. Oh, she ran out of arrows. There we go, I got him. Let's grab some of my arrows back up. Now uh, yeah, the um, mechanic of this bow is both a good thing and a bad thing. It's, I guess, it's good. You can shoot arrows so rapidly that, you know, you get so many arrows off in a short amount of time. The bad thing is, the my enemies, I mean, even like, um, hat, hat, you know, like peaceful ones, like cows and sheep and such, they have this, like, stun time after getting hit, and when they're like that, the arrows just kind of bounce off of them when hit, and if you're close enough, they can actually ricochet off of the, um, animal and hit you instead, which is pretty silly. Just, I guess why I prefer the newer version of the bow. Um, it just makes a lot more sense, and you just there's not this possibility of shooting yourself. I guess I, I, I just like it better. Then again, if you're shoot standing that close anyway, you might as well just use the sword. I guess. But yeah. There's plenty of really nice big caves here, so that's good. Look, there's another one there. Hope there isn't like someone waiting for us right up here. Okay, there isn't. And another dead end. I mean, did someone see a theme happening here? I sure can.
guys are full of these dead end things. Oh, they're being hauled back. Oh, shoot. There you go. Got him. There's so much water down here. Go ahead and venture down, shall we? Yep, there's, there's just so much cave to explore here. And it goes back up again. Okay. I guess at that end? Yes. At least there's minerals here. I don't even think weather is a thing yet. So it's like... There aren't going to be any of those random rainstorms that happen. That'll make some people happy, I suppose. Oh, Creeper, can you get up? I don't know, but I can get you. You don't seem to be able to get up, so... I think that'll be enough to make it so I can. It's more gold. Nifty. Just throw this in here. <laughs> See a lot of lava over there, so. Check over here first. There we go. Obsidian. Okay. I would need um, more diamond before I be able to mine it. But you know, you know, it's it's there. It's proven. It's like, yeah, I exist. I'm getting your facts all mixed up, you silly. Alright, I'm saying I get it. I get it. You exist. You don't have to tell me twice. I'm pretty sure portal technology is not existent. Anything in there? That doesn't look like it.
Oh, cool. I got a flint. can make an arrow if I wanted to. Oh, a pack of four. That's where the dead end. Thanks for the feathers. Zombies. They just like walk up the chickens and they're like, I'm gonna pluck your feathers. And then they do. So weird. Hopefully I haven't gotten lost. Yeah, here we are. Oh! Yes, indeed. Okay. Next, I guess we get to see what's down here. Or even up there. Down here sounds... You know what? They could pop down from there any time. So, it's like, I have to. Considering this is like even multiple caves. Nothing up here. Okay. Let's go down. Carefully as so not to get hurt. Mm -hmm. There's that cave noise. That's a thing at the moment. I just need some coal. Oh, there we go. That was convenient. Yeah, you need to make the torches first before you can plant them. <sighs> Don't forget about that. <laughs> that was unfair hit there. What's that nonsense? <laughs> oh well. I'm not gonna complain too much. There's a decently sized room here, and it's kind of cool. This is going to be another disappointing area. I hope not. Probably some lava down there. It's probably also a dead end, so let's approach carefully. A 
lava for sure. Uh, let's see, how do I get down? That's a good question. That is a very good question. Hmm, that's not gonna work either. Oh, okay. Oh shoot, I forgot the crafting area behind. And that zombie forgot its brain at home. I mean, this is zombie, I meant skeleton. That clearly was a skeleton. Clearly I forgot my brain at home too. Okay. There's plenty of cave to go around. There we go. That makes, well, one on me. I think there's like one more at the more base type area over there. So that's two. Not very smart. Yeah, that, that arrow just went right through him. He's like, you know what? Forget rolls. I don't care about them. Okay. Be careful. Okay. He was as dumb as I hoped he would be. So that went completely well. There's some gold, but a little friend who wants to hop in and join us at any time. Let's grab it and go. He's doing all right. Okay. I hear another one. I hear many. Yeah, how is he hitting me from... There. That doesn't make any sense. some of this. Oh, there's even more cave up there. I think now would be a good time to fall back, at least for now. Let's get up here and cook up the food. And then find the way out. Hopefully without dying. Uh oh, no call. Hmm. 
Is there anything here? Yeah, this piece of iron, but I don't see any coal. I was hoping there might be some behind it or something, but uh doesn't seem to be the case. There we are! Found it. Uh that was a bad idea. Cook that meat. Okay, good. That's better. I can use the remainder to cook this gold. Careful, they can just hit you over and over again. It's not pleasant. Is that an actual dungeon dungeon? Oh my gosh, I was proven wrong. Dungeons do exist. Dang. Oh no, that's bad. That was really bad. Freaking creepers. I just managed to find a dungeon, and that happens. Oh, you know what that means. Just wait, wait for this creep to die. Okay. Hmm. 